Hey, hey, what's going on YouTube? Today we're opening three boxes of Panini One Football. If you haven't seen this product before, it's literally one football card in a box called Panini One. Uh, this is a degenerate's dream gamble product. You can hit some incredible cards and uh, most of the time you'll just lose a lot of your money. But let's get into it, let's open it. It'll be a little bit of a shorter video and uh, we'll talk a little bit more about it afterwards. Let's go. Getting into box one, I really do like this product. I've only opened one in the past. I've uh, been a little bit of a fan of Panini 1 and 1, which is the basketball version of this. I've hit some pretty sick cards in there, timeless moments with uh, Jason Tatum, a Jokic patch auto. So let's hope that luck continues over into football. Um, and let's just get right into it here. I think the card's going to be right here. And quick reveal, this is a, a Jeremy Shockey. Okay, okay, all right. Once upon a time on card auto, Jeremy Shockey, 53 of 75. All right, nice, got a little bit of an, uh, an older sick player there. Very cool, very cool, 53 of 75. Uh, not really gonna do it for us value-wise, but that's okay, uh, really nice looking card. Uh, you know, pretty cool signature on card. All right, let's get the box number two. I'm gonna try to make it a little bit more exciting with the reveal, actually, than that last one. All right. So this is kind of a review. You know, do you want to risk it and open one of these, a couple of these? I'll let you know, you know, after opening a few of them, kind of what you can expect, um, which is, you know, hopefully helpful to somebody that's on the fence of opening this product. You know, I'm just gonna use this card to now reveal the next one. All right. And slowly, oh, those colors are very nice. What are the, oh my gosh. It looks like a George Pickens. I do like that. I do like George Pickens. It's a really nice patch there. Um, George Pickens. You know, he's, he does pretty well. Uh, people like his product. It's an on-card auto. Uh, it's a sick patch, nasty patch there. This is gonna be numbered to 149. All right, is that game? I'm hoping these are game used uh, for this product, but it is not. A little disappointing, but still a uh, nice card there. A very nice card, cool. Let's get into our last one. I did have a couple coming from eBay, um, but the seller has not even sent them out yet. So I don't know if I'm gonna request a refund or maybe make a couple of shorts. Uh, stay tuned for that. I hope it can help anyone decide whether they wanna buy a product or not. Let's go, Rookie Shield, very good. Those colors, maybe an Aiden Hutchinson would be cool. And it is a Panini one, Aiden Hutchinson. That is beautiful. Decent autograph, look at that patch. It's an absolutely disgusting patch, three color, a lot of seams. I love it when they have a little fold in it, it kind of brings it to life to me. Uh, Aiden Hutchinson on the uh, rookie one. And that one's gonna be numbered 70 of 99. Let's take a look at these three cards. So the Jeremy Shockey, last place for me. Uh, George Pickens, second. And uh, the, the Aiden Hutchinson is gonna be the winner for me today. <clears throat> Value wise, I haven't really looked up prices. Uh, if there are some comps, I'll put them in the video in the edit. But yeah, this is kind of what you can expect. The rookie class is not horrible. There's some good uh, QBs, but you can also get some good defensive players, wide receivers. And uh, if you do sell your cards that you open instead of just uh, stock them or store them, you can get you know some of your value back. And the way I look at that is, hey, I'm opening this product, you know, at a discount. You know, I may sell this card for 150, 200 bucks, and so it'll be $150 rip instead of 350. So if that's gonna kinda throw you over the fence and you wanna pick this up, you know, just take a, just take a gamble, 
try it out. There's some pretty sick cards in here. Uh, There's some wild one of ones in here. All right. Well, as always, thank you so much for tuning in. Have a wonderful day.